These are the four colors you're going to get. We're gonna start with one color at a time. So your plate will only have one, then I'll come around and add a second, and the third and the fourth. Um, I left out green and blue because we already have a lot of green and blue in our landscape. We're gonna use some Q-tips today. One Q-tip per color. So you'll get four Q-tips. So today we're looking to make dots rather than brush strokes. So I'm gonna dip into my red and I'm pressing down, lifting up to get a dot like a flower. And I can put those anywhere. So if I wanna keep all my red in the same area, I can, or if I wanna spread it out, that's fine too. So I can repress it in every couple flowers here. When I'm ready for a new color, I'm using a different Q-tip. So one side of the Q-tip I'm holding it on and the other side I'm dipping in. So I'm really not getting any paint on. So I shouldn't really get any paint on myself. 